Hi, welcome back to Solarization 6 as Coupe. So, I think I'm just going to use that engineer for Statue of Liberty. I know that sounds a little bit boring, but I need to build it somewhere. And I do not have a high production city I can build it in. So, I'll just finish a harbor and then we can build it here. That's the plan. I also noticed Vietnam is already getting oil. So, that's not good. I mean, she's my ally, but that means she has a refining. And I'm not too happy about that. Anyway, when we last left off, we were still at war with Scythia, and I also need seven more points to get a normal age. But I should be able to do that. We can get proselytizer, so that's useful. Then I can convert the city, and that will give me some era score. And we also got some other era score coming, so it shouldn't be a problem. We'll get Golden Age. Alright then, the next goal is to take this city right here. Should be doable, without too many problems. Here's some era score. We completed our first neighborhood district. Okay then. And we got some promotions. We also got... A pretty useful great scientist here. 500 science for each natural wonder here and adjacent. So it's perfect in my capital. Yep, definitely going to grab that. And we'll pop him right away on the next turn. That will actually give me flight. And then I can get the observation balloon right away. Definitely a good plan. So, let's see, we just finished that neighborhood. I wouldn't mind building the Great Zimbabwe somewhere, but I don't really have a good spot for it. I tried to find one, but there isn't really anything that would be very useful for it. Anyway, how about a theater square? Because I could still use that. We could also grab an industrial zone here. And possibly a water park. Like over here. That would be fine. That would remove the fishery, but that's alright. I don't need a few more water parks. So let's just grab one. My amenities are mostly at zero. And actually minus one in a few cities. And it might drop to minus one once I take more cities. Anyway, there's a promotion, so I'm actually going to use that here. And then we can merge. There we go. That's some era score, plus two. Then we can do some damage with the privateer. Yep, we'll hit this musket man. Uh, actually, hold on. He only has one turn left on him. But I can kill him regardless. Yeah, there's actually no point. Let's back up slightly with our hero and fortify. And maybe back up with the pike and shot. Then I can disembark with the bombard. It might take some damage, which I'm not too happy about. But I need the firepower. So I think I have to do it. Okay, let's do it. And then I can take a shot still. I should be able to get rid of the fortification on the next turn. And then they won't be able to use city bombardment against me. And that bombard doesn't really have a lot of experience. Plus, I can get bombards pretty quickly with my fancy new bonus. So I'm not too worried about that. Anyway, uh, let's maybe not go that close just yet. Uh, we have a builder with five builds. He was supposed to help our Petra city. Off you go then. And since I need some production over here, let's get a few mines. Eiffel will wait for the harbor to finish, because that's one of the requirements. Where do you think you're going? Uh, okay, I don't like that apostle over here. Uh, we are at war, but I don't really have any ship. So this is slightly awkward. I can still try, but we'll see about that. 
I should get some ship over here, just to defend myself or something. Okay, they didn't kill anything. Yeah, she did a really poor job picking the targets. She could have destroyed at least one unit, but she did not. Okay then, so let's see. Duplicates of the Chosen Luxury grant amenities. Let's vote for Wales. There's a decent chance that will pass. Because there are a lot of Wales all over the place. Yup, Wales. Nice. Okay then. We got a boost. Or rather inspiration. That was a little bit close on the privateer. But it's fine. And now we can merge these guys. There you go. Heal up the musket men. And... Okay, so... I could hit the city with my Bombard. It's a little bit risky, but it might actually be fine. Let's do it like this. There, that's some error score as well. Then we can take a shot. Use the Apostle. Like this. Should be able to convert the city on the next turn. And that will give me enough error score for the Golden Age already. So there you go, problem solved. Now, before we pop this guy, let's queue something up. I would like to get refining. But... I wouldn't mind electricity. Still, I'm going to need oil. It's unlikely I will be able to kill anything with a knight, so... Let's just queue up refining here. Alright? So this is going to be 1500 science. Pretty good with my current science output. There it is, that's some error score. And we got flight. And I already have enough. I mean, not for a golden age, for a normal age. But that's okay. Alright, let's get a few mines over here to get more production. And I think I queued up yeah, a holy site over here. Because that will be plus four. And plus 8 with scripture, meaning I will also get plus 8 production from it, which will stack with my other production. I think that's going to be my second top production city pretty soon. Oh hey, that apostle basically decided to commit suicide. <laughs> Works for me. Thanks for your cooperation. Yeah, now I should probably back up with the bombard. There's yet another boast. And another Bombard, and another great person. Here you go. Uh, yeah, let's maybe back up. I don't want to lose a Bombard if I don't have to. I could hit the city with my hero, which is probably fine. I mean, the hero is not permanent, and I won't take that much damage. I actually don't need a Rascor anymore. Not right now, but I would still like to convert the city. So let's just convert it. I could almost try to get that Golden Age. I would need 10 more points. I don't think I can get 10 more points this fast. But I'm not sure. Oh, here's a nice industry that will be useful. Plus 20% growth and plus free housing in the host city. Yeah, let's grab that. Don't quite need housing in here right now. But if I could get a corporation with this, that would be really good. And I could certainly use the yields. So, let's grab it. Yeah, look at the yields, that's pretty nice. What's next? Yeah, that's a builder. Could still use that. And we still got Liang in here. So, a few more fisheries. I might just keep Liang in this city. I wouldn't mind an aerodrome. I don't need an aerodrome somewhere. This isn't a bad spot for an aerodrome, actually. Might not be a bad idea. I need to build one somewhere. So let's just grab an aerodrome here. And it might be useful in the future uh, for airlifting, in case I end up needing it. Do we have professional army right now? Uh, yes, we do. So let's just upgrade. Might as well. I don't have enough nighter for the warrior, that's okay. Alright, let's get the improvements. Look at these yields. 
Yeah, this city is going to be amazing. Uh, three more. Yeah, let's get some production around here for all these cities. All right. Where can I pop the artist? I think I only have like, yeah, one art museum right now over here. You guys just wait. Okay, it should be just a matter of time before we take this city. She is trying to defend it, However beautiful this but I'm pretty sure she's going to fail. Now, let's see. Let's just keep hitting it with the hero. We will do some decent damage and I'm barely taking any damage myself. And possibly hit it with the frigate as well. I just want to take it as soon as possible. So, one more bombard. It's not a core, but it's still useful. These guys will heal up. It will be a core soon. And then... Yeah, neighborhood. Now we got 19 housing in here. Yeah, let's grab the aquarium to get some amenities. I clearly need amenities. Don't need the apostle over here anymore. We can back up and send him elsewhere. And I'll just spam mines. Yep. I'll probably need more builders, but that's okay. So, pop the artist. Maybe I could get a theming bonus, that would be nice. I also need an archaeologist, but I'll have to get one in my capital. Which might take a little bit of time, because I'm slightly busy with military production. Okay. Nope, not interested, sorry. She does have some decent units. Okay, okay. Let's see, I might have to use that privateer fleet right now. I think it healed up enough. So, let's take them out. Yeah, back up. I could take him out right now with my hero. Which should give me some error score. But it might be better to fortify. Yeah, let's fortify. There's another bombard. Now I could get some more ships. That would definitely be useful. Or grab that archaeologist. That's only four turns. However, I only need two turns to get a privateer. I don't have enough niter right now. Yeah, let's get at least one more privateer because I'll need that for an armada anyway. So that's that. Okay, what else? Nowhere I can disembark safely. Well, I could disembark over here and just wait for that observation balloon. Yeah, speaking of which, we should be getting the observation balloon. Where is it? Yeah, right here. Let's get that instead of the privateer. And just merge with that other bombard here. And I'll just wait two turns for the observation balloon. Then I could attack the city from the style. That will be much, much safer. Alright, more mines. Here, nice yields. Uh, this looks like a hill. Kind of hard to see, but it's there. Okay, any more fisheries? Yep, certainly. There you go. Done. Next. Apparently we satisfied his agenda, which is fun-loving. Okay, well, that guy decided to kill himself, apparently. Now I can take out the bombard. Yeah, let's do that. That should be easy. There we go, it's down, and we can attack the city a bit. Or the unit. Yeah, she's still sending units. But I need to take the city, let's focus on the city. Right, now the bombard needs to go here. So, disembark, send the balloon. Maybe upgrade this guy. That also gives us a boost, which I needed. What about the Apostle? So, he would be useful to convert 
uh, some other cities. Uh, also, I need to spread my religion. I could also just use him on my own cities. It's not exactly a big deal. And I don't want these apostles around here. Yeah, I can't really ask him because he's my ally. Let's just use him on the Petra city because that city needs to have my religion. And I can grab an Inquisitor just in case to use later. We don't have over 1000 faith. Let's see if we can boast any great person here. And not right now, but I could boast the next great engineer once I get a little bit closer. Might not be a bad idea, we shall see. Okay, we got three more builds. So, just get mines. Yep. Here you go. Another fishery. I'll probably harvest this resource eventually. Oh wait, I can't, because I'm Coopet. <laughs> yeah, it's easy to forget that. Here's some more Erascore. And we got Conservation, which unlocks Sanctuary. I definitely need that. In several of my cities. What about Civics? Yeah, now we can grab Scorched Earth, and then Mobilization to unlock armies. Good plan. There's a water park for some amenities. Okay, the amenity situation is looking much better now. City-states look fine. I'll check my policies in just a moment. Okay, more production. Time to back up with the frigate. Okay, so let's disembark here. I could even attack right now. Yeah, we will kill him. This guy is pretty weak. Uh, he didn't quite die there, apparently. Well, there we go. Fixed. Give me that balloon. Alright, now I can attack on the next turn. I'll just have to move the balloon one more time. This should speed things up considerably. Two more builds. Yeah, let's just focus on production here. I need production in that general area. Buy some more tiles. We can certainly afford it. There you go. That will be a nice tile to work. Nope, not interested. Sorry. I think I'll go for more cities once we're done with this one. I want more than just one single city from her. Okay, so now we can go for reform the coinage. It's not a golden age, so two arms will not give me the CB. Reform the coinage will be better. Especially since I will be getting more trade routes. We have two harbors under construction. So there's the privateer. Now I could grab the water park. We could grab the coal power plant. I don't have enough coal. We could also get some products. Not a terrible idea. Uh, let's grab that archaeologist, because I need to get him. A stock exchange, good. Factory next. Two more builds. Yeah, like I said, mines. And converted. The holy site is about to finish, so good timing. There, that's a lot of fisheries. Now, let's see. First, move the balloon. Then we can attack. Yeah, let's focus on the city, because it should be mined pretty damn soon. Very, very soon. Kill the cavalry. There's some era score. I should be able to get a golden age for our next era. Pretty easily as well. Promotion. You guys heal up. Yeah, musket man. I'll need more to merge him, but that's okay. He's not super strong right now, so I'll keep him in the back. Slightly. Now, uh, where do we build the sanctuaries? Down here, for sure. I mean, in every city that has the preserve. Uh, wait, this city does not have the preserve. Uh, this one does. So let's queue that up right away. That will be a nice bonus. Where the heck is it? 
right there. Yeah, that will take a while, but I definitely need it. I also had a preserve right here. So after the aquarium. Where else? Let me just use the search. Did I even have more preserves? They take a while to build. As much as I like them, it's kind of hard to spam them. If not impossible with how much they cost to build. Okay, that's the only two I have right now. I'll probably build more now that we unlock the sanctuary. We'll see about that. So next up we got refining and I can definitely boss that. In fact, we should boss that for sure. Let's get that coal power plant right away. The archaeologists can wait, I need this boost, like, now. Okay, so, let's do some damage here. Uh, yeah, I can kill him. Yeah, how about the city? Can we take it yet? Probably on the next turn. Okay, not just yet. Actually, it kind of looks like I can. But it might still be better to wait one turn. I don't think they will be able to take it back instantly, but I'm not 100% sure about that. So it might be safer to still wait one turn. Let them move towards us, and maybe I can do some damage. I just want to play it safe. Not that I mind flipping it back and forth, but I would prefer to avoid that, if possible. So we got the holy site. Might as well build a shrine and all that. There, convert the city. So now it will be getting plus 8 production. We are already at 61 and I'm like nowhere close to done with this city. I'll definitely grab a preserve somewhere around here. At least I think so. Mines might be better because preserve requires decent appeal. Yeah, and I just don't have that here. So, let's focus on mines. Right, there's the aerodrome. Let's grab the hangar. And then we can get the aeroscore by building a biplane. Well, first I'll need oil, but we are working on that. Hopefully we actually have oil. I suppose we'll find out. If I don't have oil, I might be able to take it from Setia. Hopefully. That's the plan. Okay, I got all... no, not all the fisheries. Uh, yeah, all the fisheries I could get. Okay, that's fine. I think I'll keep Liang in here to focus on this city. Maybe grow it a bit faster than this. Yeah, if I want to focus on growth, I will sacrifice quite a bit of production, but it can grow a lot. So I would prefer to focus on that. It looks like we will get that city Dido started. I don't necessarily want it, so I'm not sure what I'm going to do about that when it flips. Because I don't really want it, it's not well, a good city. I would prefer to see it gone. Do we change any policies here? I think I'm good with all this. I think so. Yeah, this looks fine. Okay, now we could take the city, I think. I mean, not much actually changed. But I need to take it sooner or later, preferably sooner. Okay, let's just do it. I got 16 more turns on the hero. So it does look like the hero can take it. Then I could take a shot at the musket man with my bombard. That sounds like a good plan. There we go, nice. Now we can take a shot at the Masked Man, that's 22 damage. So this gives me an encampment. Is this my first encampment in the game? On turn 216 that I captured from Scythia? Yeah, it is, because I never actually built one. That's pretty funny. Obviously we'll keep the city. In theory, I could peace out right now. But I don't necessarily want to. 
Especially if I don't know where oil is. I need to know where oil is. And we will know soon. Yeah, let's stay at war. This looks like a pretty decent city right here. And it has a wonder. So it would be nice for like a theater square. Yeah, let's stay at war. Fine, we'll stay at war. Especially since I can't use Golden Age CB anymore. So once I peace out, that will not be an option until the next era, potentially. Right, yeah, I don't think I will be switching any policies. Now, uh, about that Statue of Liberty. Here, let's just grab that. And I'll boss that with Eiffel. Uh, that dam can wait. Yeah, I don't think I need skyscrapers anymore. We can replace that with something else. What would that be? Well... Plus 11 from Natural Philosophy, probably not worth it. 11 is not that much. I don't really need Medina Quarter. Colonial Taxes, now that's not too bad. Plus 10 production and plus 15 gold. This also looks good. Okay, with as many city-states as I got, this is actually a good policy right now. I very rarely used it in the past, if ever. But this is actually pretty decent compared to other options. Heck yeah, let's get that. That is actually pretty decent. There we go. Let me check great people real quick. Okay, I could get the Great Admiral, but I'm not necessarily interested. I think I'll just grab the Engineer here. And then we could use him in some low-production city that's about to finish an industrial zone. Let's see. Well, this one is already working on a workshop. It literally just started. This one. 36. 40. They all have reasonably decent production. Uh, this one, 43. So that's also kind of decent. And I already have a workshop in this city. Oh, also, I have economics now, uh, so I can use the great merchants to start corporations. Now, I think this will be one of the corporations for sure. That seems like a no-brainer, as far as I'm concerned. And yes, I can see that the religion flipped. Not for long, it's fine. Yeah, okay, so this is going to be one of the corporations. Uh, let's go there right away. Where the heck are they? Right here? Yeah, so let's go for that. Off you go. And the second one, where's the second one? Oh yeah, I already used the other one to get the military production bonus, that's fine. So this is going to be the second for growth and housing. Definitely useful. So more mines, and let's continue our business with Scythia. Maybe back up with that pike and shot. I don't want anything funny happening there. Let's see if they will be able to retake this city here. I don't think so, but I'm not 100% sure about that. Yeah, I'm not accepting that because I want more. Okay, yeah, they didn't do much of anything, really. They didn't even try. So, let's do this. I'm pretty sure they are running out of firepower because they have to keep bringing city steady units. Okay, I will let that granary finish. I am just going to buy the monument because we have 3000 gold. And then we'll build walls. Kind of need them here, I suppose. Okay, you need to heal up, clearly. Are we at war with any city-states? Yes, we are. Not with this one, that's mine. Yeah, none of the city-states I'm at war with are anywhere close. So this shouldn't be a problem. 
Now, let's reveal oil and see if we have it. Surely we have it somewhere, right? <laughs> Famous last words. I certainly hope so, but I have quite a lot of territory. Okay, five turns to finish Touch of Liberty. Good enough for me. There's a promotion. Good timing. And yeah, let's grab the first. Bring the other bombard. I'll probably get another observation balloon as well. Right, this is converted. Done. Okay, two more turns and we'll find out where oil is. Apart from the sanitation. Third sanitation. Nice yields. Okay, I got 14 more turns on my hero. So, let's go for the next city. They still don't have city walls in this one, which is a little bit weird. But hey, I'm not complaining. That will make my job that much easier. So... Yeah, let's move closer right away. I can start attacking on the next turn, once we move the balloon. Next up, electricity. Or we can get started on steel to get artillery. And I will be able to boss that. I'm just going to need an ironclad, which we can build, right? Pretty sure I can. Yeah, right here. So let's get that. I keep delaying that poor archaeologist, but I mean, this is kind of more important. Nice warrior, bro. What you planning to do with him? <laughs> Poke someone with a stick? Apparently, yeah. And not sure what I was going to do down here. Probably nothing. Because we are better off leaving the forest without improvements. Come on, show me my oil. Wait, I can't get a corporation here. Oh, I don't think we have enough. Is this not improved? No, it's improved. I don't have enough copies. Apparently. Let me check. Yeah, we need at least three. And I only have two. Okay, then. Well, in that case, I would have to steal it from someone. Which I might be able to do. Yeah, this would be a nice one to have. Let's see if we can steal it from Scythia. I really thought I had a third one somewhere. But I guess not. Well, technically, I could take a third one from the city once it flips. Maybe it's worth it just for that purpose alone. Can't say I'm convinced. Yeah, these are my only two copies, so I can't get that corporation. Oh well. I'll have to think about that one. Uh, yeah, we will renew the alliances. Probably all of them. I have a target. So let's stick to our current target. Now, show me the oil. Engineering is the op we have oil. Nice. Several. Here's one. Nice. We have at least one land-based oil. I beat the Statue of Liberty on oil. <laughs> okay, that's kind of funny. We got Statue of Liberty on top of oil. We took liberating oil a little bit too literally, apparently. Uh, well, it looks like this is the only land-based oil I have. Which means I need a builder here. I could just buy a builder, but it shouldn't take too long to recruit one. Yeah, five turns. Wait, what was this? Oh, tempo, I think. That can wait. Carry on. Yeah, we can build the Gurdwara the regular way. That's fine. If I'm going to buy a builder, it's going to be here. To get more mines. For our fancy Petra city. Now, let's start attacking, shall we? The next city should be pretty easy to take. I might as well attack it with my hero. Because I won't be keeping the hero forever anyway. Uh, this would be a decent preserve, potentially, but I think I'm better off with improvements. 
However, that's going to be the end of this episode, so thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. Leave a like if you did to denounce the YouTube algorithm as its tradition, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.